Hi, welcome back to my kitchen. I'm Barbara Stafford, author of Eclectic Entertaining, 15 complete dinner party menus for busy people who like to cook. Today we're celebrating Memorial Day, which is the last Monday in May. It launches the summer picnic season and I have got the perfect dish for you to bring to your next picnic or for the one you're going to have at your house. Today we're going to make a watermelon fruit basket that's like as easy as it gets, but it's so darn cute, even the kids will like it. I've already made half of it, but I want to show you how I did it. First of all, you get a watermelon, big or small, and you cut across the top where you want the handle to be, okay? And if you need to use a Sharpie marker to mark it, if you're not really sure about how to do this, go ahead, but I'm just going to wing it here. I'm gonna cut this chunk out, first of all. And you do this when the watermelon is still intact. I went ahead and cleaned out the watermelon ahead of time because obviously I've done half of it, but normally you'd still have all, all the watermelon in there. So you take that nice wedge out, and then take this really cool little knife that's shaped like a V, and you just start making the little rivets in it. And go all the way around the entire watermelon. And you do the same with the handle. Then you fill the watermelon with a fruit salad. I've already made a fruit salad. You can put any fruit together, whatever's handy, whatever's seasonal. And one thing I love is strawberries. You ever fought with the little strawberry greens? Yeah, me too. So I take those out and at the end of my melon baller, I've got this really cool little jagged tomato shark, it's called. And I just scoop that right out. How cool is that, right? Here's my strawberry all ready to go. And then for the melon, I used this melon baller end for the cantaloupe. So that made a really nice little ball. So what you do is just take your, you've got your nice basket and fruit salad, fill it right up. And when you go to a potluck, another handy thing is you will have nothing to bring home besides a spoon. So if you need to leave early, you just leave this cute little fruit basket behind and you don't have to worry about having your dish returned. Okay, guys. I'm ready for my picnic. How about you? What do you think? Thank you for watching my episode today. I hope you have a wonderful Memorial Day weekend and I hope you try my watermelon fruit basket. This is great. Change it up, throw some cinnamon in, any kind of fruit will work. It's a keeper. Thank you for watching this episode. Please be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel, like me on Facebook, and follow me on Instagram at Eclectic Entertaining. Also, check out my website for more easy and elegant recipes.